Aloha YouTube, what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero and welcome to episode 15 of our brand new Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play where we're doing absolutely everything that the game has to offer. In the last episode we're here on Akala Island, we upgraded our clothing which I further upgraded off screen and now all we have are these stupid red shoes um, but then we did everything here in Hia Hia City um, and even did some um, some Mantine surfing back and forth. If you want to check out that last episode, make sure you check the iCard at the top of the screen. Now, I had said today's episode was going to be an hour of power, like this episode is going to be an hour of power. I don't know what I was thinking. It's every 10 episodes that we do that, not every 5. So today will just be a regular episode, but in today's episode, we are going to make our way through Route 4 and see where we go from there. So if you're excited for today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new, because if we're gonna make this the best Let's Play on YouTube, I need your help. I'm doing everything I can, I need your help, and I appreciate it oh so much. Let's go ahead and start off, I guess, with a team recap. Nothing has changed. Uh... Okay, nothing has changed at all. But we have Buttons, our Dartrix, with Razor Leaf, Peck, Tackle, and Ominous Wind holding the Quick Claw. We have Lauren, our Trumbeak, with Pluck, Supersonic, Echoed Voice, Brick Break, holding the Flyam Z. Negative Vibes, our Munchlax, with Tackle, Brick Break, Defense Crow, and Amnesia, holding the Leftovers. And lastly, we have Lindsay, our Rock Ruff, with Tackle, Bite, Thunder Fang, and Rock Throw, holding the Normalium B. Now in today's episode, we are going to again be leading with negative vibes. And we might potentially be adding some a, a new member to the team. Not gonna, I'm certainly not gonna turn off the, the possibility of it. But we're finally gonna be getting into some battles. We haven't done battles in a couple episodes. I just wanna battle some people, like Bellhop Jody. My bell Can we talk about the dead region of the green screen right down there? I think it's because there's no light. I think that's what it is. So let's see if we can take on this Faux Mantis. Speaking of Faux Mantis. He used growth. I'm not worried about that, am I? Wow, we're avoiding our Munchlax. I didn't check the name. I'm pretty sure we're a neutral nature. I'm pretty sure I did check it now that I think about it. We also found out in the last episode that once we get a Snorlax, we can go back to the, um, that, that Tide, Tide, Tide Song Hotel. My fault. I clicked the wrong thing. Tide Song Hotel, right? Yeah, the Tide Song Hotel and get the, Snor uh, the Snorlium Z. <clears throat> now, the one Pokemon... <clears throat> well, we have a Mudbray. Do I want to add a Mudbray to the team? He just used Mud Slap. He just used Mud Slap, didn't he? Good. That's fine. I don't know if I want to add one of these, um, because I don't want my team to just be the same team that I went through the original Sun and Moon with. Like, that's no fun. Let's see if we can get him to not call for help after one more Brick Break. If we can even hit it. Wait, what did he try to use that didn't affect me? Lower my accuracy all you want, big guy. Actually, that's kind of annoying because I'm going to have to go heal because of my, my PP. Oh no, not Mud Sport! Don't Mud Sport me! Okay, my... I've got too much mud in my eyes, I can't see anything. Alright, don't call for help, please. I actually had to buy Pokeballs. My brain cannot wrap around the fact that I had to buy Pokeballs after I had a code for a hundred Pokeballs. Thank you for staying in the ball. So we have Mudbray to add to the team. 
I mean, maybe we could add it for now and just replace it later. So I always call my mud brays, or I guess the one mud bray I've had, call it Dapada. I don't want to go too much into that. It's just a family name for, uh, it's just an in-family name. So let's just leave it at that. Cleaning up our boy Munchlax here. I did not do any, uh, anything here I really you know what I don't really even want to because as soon as we have what you call it um, as soon as we have uh, oh my gosh I'm drawing a huge blank once we have Poke Pelago, oh my goodness, that took me forever. Once we have Pelago, um, like our happiness will max out immediately. How many people have you seen found, find that super potion? Did you find that super potion when you were playing through? I doubt it, I doubt it. Expanded Let's Play. This guy says he's a collector. Collector what, butt whoopings? Cause that's all you getting from me, my guy. So you think you're funny? You think you think you're funny? He thinks he's funny. Level oh, 14. Ah, what are you gonna do? Amnesia? Right, 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 right. But it looks like he does. He just jumps. Gone. Get him out of here. I don't like me some negative vibes. Who's next? Dagon. Dragon type? I mean, sure, I'll stay in. I just want to train negative vibes up to being like where everybody else is as well. Actually, you know what? This island, I think we're finally going to catch. We're finally going to get to the rest of our team. I'm going to fill out the team a bit more. There are some Pokemon in this on this island that I do want to catch that I did not use in my first playthrough. Oh wait! You know what? I just realized that one of the ones I was just thinking of, we already have a grass type. We don't need another grass type. I'm just trying to use Pokemon that don't get used everywhere. You know what I mean? Let's just tackle him. Oh no, Ember! All right, good job. Good job, Negative Vibes. Lecter Bryant. Gimme, gimme. No, you're not gonna take my Munchlax just cause your Munchlax sucks. Go take, if you're on the island trial, you just didn't explore very well. See these two? Pikachu Valley, Electric Paradise. I rely on apps for traveling accommodations. Don't we all? It's 2017 and never mind. Never mind. What you got? Oh, you're our Kanto visitors. I remember you from the first game. I remember you. You remember me? You don't remember me, do you? But I probably o code you in that game too. Having Brick Break this early on is wild. I guess I still haven't mastered- I like that he's moving! Oh my gosh! How many trainers move after you beat them? I like that. Uh, I guess I can just jump down here and just come back. Adrenaline more. Okay, well that just confirmed that. Hey. This area looks different than it did in the first game. You say you've lost your boyfriend. He's... 
He's right there. He's right there. I get it, you're both vacationing from Alola, or from Kanto. I get it. Alola. Welcome. This is how we treat people in Alola. Why are you gonna be faster than me? I guess it's a Meowth. I don't know why I asked that. She's moving too. Okay, I'm gonna have to pay attention. Do all trainers move after they're after they get whooped? When looking at your Pokemon summary page, you can change your Raymond's move. Yeah, thank you. Alright, let's head in here. Welcome to Pikachu Valley! That's what the Pikachu here... That's what the Pikachu are saying anyway! You get this special Pikachu themed present to celebrate your first visit to Pikachu Valley. Decorate photos in your photo album with that and it'll always be Pikachu Valley in your heart. Hey, Pokemon Company, we get it. We get it. We get it. We understand. We comprehend. What is this view? If I wait here for something, is something cool gonna happen? They can code this view in. Never mind. Did you need something? What's Pikachu Valley? Pikachu Valley is a valley where a lot of Pikachu like to gather. Some of the Pikachu from this valley have even gone on to become stars. One of our greatest stars enjoying a relaxing vacation at Hano Grand Resort right now, I hear. Pikachu. Pikachu. Use me. Pikachu. I get it. Moving on. What are these views? Pokemon Company, we get it! Pikachu. Pikachu. Yes, let's do, let's do a Pikachu quiz. There are five questions in total. Try to get every single one right. By what part of a Pikachu's body can you tell whether it's a male or female? It's tail. What are the particular parts of a Pikachu's cheeks called? The electric sacs. What do you need to evolve a Pikachu into a Raichu? Understood. How is a shiny Pikachu different from more common Pikachu specimens? It is see-through. It is darker. Pikachu can evolve from, that's right, Pichu. But who was the first person to discover the existence of Pichu? Had to have been Elm. That's the end of our quiz. To announce the results, your total number of correct answers was... Five out of five! Yeah, you got them all right. That's electrifying. True Pikachu master. Here's a little gift to help you by acing... Yeah, help you celebrate acing the quiz for the first time. Thunderstone. Pikachu shirt and Pikachu cap. I'll try again sometime. Pikachu. That Pikachu, she never seems to warm up to anyone. Though I did see her smile beautifully at this one Pikachu wearing a cap once. Alright, what happens when I do this? What happens when I do this? I like that it's a lot faster when you do it multiple times. Give 
me out of here. I can't. Pokemon Company, we get it. Wait, oh, you're together now. It's a mystery whose recommendation it is, but Pikachu Valley is apparently really nice. We're all travels in life, always looking for something or other. Please tell me they did not reduce... Please tell me they did not reduce Route 4 to that. Wow, Route 4 used to be really cool. Interesting. Interesting choices, Game Freak. Send me a grubbin. Just thinking about our team, man. Unsure of what to do. I'm sure of what to do. That's annoying! Ugh, man, my voice is terrible. Just gonna take a drink here real quick while we... Uh, while we continue to press run away. I'm not gonna get mad. It's too early for negative vibes. <laughs> it's too early for this. Thank you. Thank you, Grubbin. Is that an axe in his hand? The first step to surpassing Captain Mallow is to strengthen my Pokemon. You plotting? You plotting over here, boy? You plotting against me, boy? Oh, it's a ladle. It's a ladle. Never mind. I thought it was a axe. You have a cutie fly, and your goal is to surpass the uh, the trial captain. Oh no, silver wind! Ah. Excuse me. Person has leftovers? Oh! I guess that it does make sense. So very weird. Why why does an NPC have leftovers? I don't know, I kinda like it. I'm down. Also, we've done a we've done just fine staying on staying on par even without using the experience share at all. I haven't touched the experience share once, it's turned off. I don't plan on turning it on. Alright, negative vibes. I need you to pop out. I need you to hit through this. Quick. Ruggle bug. I feel like it's gonna hurt. Gotcha. Ah. Yeah. Good job, negative vibes. You only gave me $560. I know you're hurting. I know you're not feeling so great. I got you. I got you, my guy. Got you. There we go. Now you feel better. Rub your little tummy. Alright, let's move on. So we're here now in Paniola, unless a, a brawler wants to pop out at us for the first time. Yep, there it goes. So I've got to catch this guy because I have not managed to run into one. And there's a quest that I have over on... Uh... Oh. Uh, let's go. I guess let's go here. This will be fine. Um, there's a quest on the Pokemon Center on Route 2. That we need to take this crawler to. Uh, we get paid. Alright, I'm gonna hit it with another one. Rock smash? Oh. Whoa! Why'd that do so much? Don't call for help. Don't call for help. No! Uh, okay. 
Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and attack. I should be able to take this thing out in one hit. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Bubble. All right, please don't call for help. Thanks. Please stay in the Pokeball. These Pokemon have a higher catch rate in this game. I'm just convinced that they up the catch rate in this game. Thank you! Goodness gracious! Yesterday I got so tired of catching Pokemon because it was just taking forever. Negative vibes grows to level 14 and wants to learn chip away. Absolutely. Get rid of tackle. Tackle sucks. Oh yeah, that's that. That's that DX racer chair right there. Ooh. Oh yeah. All right, here we go. So we caught ourselves a crow brawler. And we would consider using him if we could evolve him sooner in the game than we can. But we cannot, so we're just gonna say no. Awesome. Lumberry to hear them burns. Piggyberry to restore something after something. A guavberry, I don't know what that does. Still don't know what it does. And I, I like how it wanted to give me another try. I could probably learn. I might actually learn since I'm doing uploads now. Cabal. Oh, I thought I could walk up there. Oh. <laughs> Wait, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Hey, Domino, glad I ran into you so we can see who's stronger now. I got a Z power ring from my Gramps, too, after making it through his grand trial. Having a battle in a place like Paniola Town feels like we're in a real old fashioned Western showdown or something, right? This is so cool. So, for really, uh, real honorable cowboys, we've got to make sure our teams are healthy first. Yeah, Mill Tank, Snubble. All right, team. A white. All right. All right. All right, team. All right, team. Brianna, Pikachu, and everybody. You ought to be bursting out with energy after eating a pile of my mom's special pancakes. So let's see how this newbie's... How the, let's show this newbie what Alola's got. Wait. Wait a minute. Pancakes? How have you been training? How? How? I love that. I think that's so... I think that's such a nice touch. Alright, how? I know it looks like I've got six Pokemon, but really only four of them are trained. Uh, I'll go in the buttons. Just because I don't want to lose. What level did it say that was? Level 18? 19 something? Oh, it's only level 16. Unfort. There's no way I'm over leveled. You can't even start to tell me I'm over leveled. I, I haven't used the experience share. The only way I, you could possibly say I'm over leveled is because I did catch some Pokemon where I had to. Uh... My Quick Claw popped, but you use priority. You're cool. You're cool. Oh, there's level 20. Jeez. Okay, you're about to send in your Pikachu. I'll send in Lindsay. Um, that's fine. Go with. I don't know what all he's got hiding in the back. Yes! Good job, Lindsay. Electro Ball. Surely you're not that much faster than... Okay, you. I guess you're decently faster than me. It did more than I was expecting it to do. Alright, he got, he's got two more Pokemon. 
have to send in his Noibat. I will not switch out. Which means we're going to hit level 20 here as well. Are we overleveled? I don't know what to do if I'm overleveled. Like, I'm, I'm already starting to... I'm focusing on, like, Munchlax and stuff, but... I send an Eevee. Yeah, let's switch. Let's let Lauren come in, because we're level 20 on these two. Oh, wait! Why didn't I go in back in the Munchlax? I'll switch. I'll switch. I'll switch. Uh, negative. Up. I definitely meant to switch into here, so I can just Brick Break, because this thing won't live. I was thinking about picking up an Eevee of my own, and we can uh, get ourselves an Umbreon. Because on, you know what? We're doing it. I just decided. Whew, like, I ju I just decided. We're getting ourselves an Umbreon. We're getting ourselves an Umbreon. I don't know that I've, like, I don't really remember the last time I used an Umbreon. Well, obviously, except for an Emerald, but... Nice! How'd you come up with that kind of battle plan? You gotta tell me! Uh, I pressed A a bunch. Pretty much what it was. Pretty much how I came up with that plan. What did I get hit with? Oh, well... But Brion just used Disarming Voice a bunch. I don't think it... Oh, it hit me with with Aqua Jet. You okay there? You sneeze? Was that a sneeze? Oh. Sneasel. Uh, man, that was some kind of battle. Brion and everybody all looked like they had a blast, too. Be lucky I didn't hit that. Hit that little... <laughs> I did the wrong way. This way, then this way. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I almost hit it that time. I almost hit it that time. You know how the totem Pokemon are all like surrounded by some sort of aura power? If you use a dire hit in your Pokemon and manage to land a critical hit, that aura won't mean a thing. You might want to try using some of those Rotom powers when you're fighting a totem too. You know, Pokemon battles are like, just sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. But you're only really a loser if you don't have a fun time battling, right? I feel like I paraphrase a lot, but we're going to heal and then we're going to call it an episode. We made it through Route 4. They really did change Route 4 a lot. So wait, how do I get to... I'm confused. I have a question. A new uh, uh, a bad nature lowers defense up special defense. Uh. All right, so we're gonna call an episode right here, right in the center. Today's episode consisted of Route 4 and a battle with How. Just as promised, we made it here to Paniola Town. In the next episode, I don't know where we go from here. I thought Route 4 was gonna be a little longer than that. I thought we were going to encounter some people that we hadn't met yet, uh, but we'll see what happens in the next episode. If you wound up enjoying today's video, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new. If we're going to grow the way that we want to and make this the best Let's Play on YouTube, I'm going to need your help doing so. We will see you tomorrow for the next three episodes of Pokemon Ultra Moon, the expanded Let's Play. Until then, have a blessed day.